Undervalued homes continue to quell fears of a new housing bubble while mobile technology becomes an increasingly important investment for on-the-go realtors. Coming up on this weekend's News Wrap. Homes in a majority of major markets across the country remain slightly undervalued, squashing any concerns of a rising housing bubble, according to the latest data from Trulia's Bubble Watch. Nationally, homes remain undervalued by 3%. The company determines whether a market is overvalued or undervalued by comparing home prices to price-to-income ratio, price-to-rent ratio, and long-term price trends. Market-level data reveals 76 of the 100 largest metros remain undervalued, and most of the overvalued markets are less than 10% overvalued. Furthermore, Trulia points out even today's most overvalued markets are nowhere near the bubble levels of overvaluation. For example, Orange County, California, the most overvalued market, is currently overvalued by 17 percent compared to 71 percent at the height of the bubble in 2006. Overall, Trulia expects national home prices to rise to a neutral level, neither undervalued nor overvalued, by the end of this year or the start of next year. The company believes that slowing price gains at the national level leave no concerns for a rising bubble. The National Association of Realtors released its 2013-2014 Realtor Technology Survey, which found that realtors continue to invest in technology for their business in 2013 and spent more than they had in previous years. According to the survey, brokers spent a median of $1,410 on technology for their real estate business, up from $1,122 in 2012. The survey found that technology that allows work to be done while on the move generated the most interest for both brokers and agents. You can find more on these stories and all your latest industry headlines right here on our site. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again on Monday. Until then, stay with DSNews.com for all of your most relevant default servicing news.